Hi, this is Em from WCCF Tech, and AMD's Ryzen 9 6900 HX APU benchmarks have leaked out the same day Intel lifts the embargo of its 12th generation mobility lineup. The AMD Ryzen 9 6900 HX and the Ryzen 9 6900 HX APUs are going to be the flagship offering within AMD's Rembrandt H line of notebook chips. The processors will be featuring the brand new Zen 3 Plus cores, which are the upgraded versions of the ones featured on the Zen 3 Sienna lineup, and they will also utilize the brand new 6 nanometer architecture to deliver higher clocks for faster performance. Specification wise, the AMD Ryzen 9 6900 HX will be offering 8 cores and 16 threads. The chips will feature 16 megabytes of L3 cache, 4 megabytes of L2 cache, and the base clocks for both chips is rated at 3.3 gigahertz, and boost clocks are rated up to 4.9 gigahertz. As such, the HX series processors will come with a higher thermal range, and TDP is rated beyond 45 watts. One of the biggest changes within the lineup is going to be the addition of AMD's RDNA 2 graphics architecture. The top tier models will feature the AMD Radeon 680M GPU with 12 compute units or 768 cores which will be clocked around 2 GHz. This will deliver a huge uplift in performance over the aging Vega graphics. Furthermore, the APUs will be housed within the LPDDR4X and DDR5 options for faster bandwidth. Now, coming to the benchmarks. The Lenovo 82RG laptop was spotted by bench leaks within the Geekbench 5 database, the AMD Ryzen 9 6900 HX, and featuring 32 gigabytes of memory. The APU scores up to 1,616 single-threaded points and 10,151 multi-threaded points. For comparison, the previous generation, the AMD Ryzen 9 5900HX scores 1,417 single-threaded points and 7,658 multi-threaded points on average. That's a 14% increase in single-core and a 33% increase in multi-core CPU performance in a single generation with a similar but more optimized core. The Ryzen 9 6900HX does run higher when compared, but the additional performance is coming from the optimized 6 nanometer node that enables stable clocks operations when compared to Sienna. However, compared to Intel's Alder Lake Core i9-12900H, you can expect a 21% increase in single and a 44% increase in multi-threaded performance for the Blue Team's mobility chip when compared to even AMD's newest flagship. The Intel CPU runs at 100 MHz higher clock speed, offers more cores and threads, but the biggest reason for the huge difference in performance is the wattage. Intel has a maximum turbo power of 115 watts. So, a Core i9-12900H with a fully unlocked power limit on high-end laptop designs is going to consume way more power, leading to lower battery times unless you keep the notebook plugged into the socket all the time. Overall, the AMD Ryzen 6000H Rampart APU lineup with Zen 3 Plus cores is a decent upgrade over the Ryzen 5000H Sienna APU lineup, but for those wanting more performance, it's best you wait for AMD's next generation Raphael H and Phoenix H chips, which are expected to be announced at the next CES next year at 2023. But what do you think? Will a laptop with the AMD Ryzen 6000H APU lineup be part of your next mobile gaming setup? Let us know in the comments down below, and don't forget to subscribe for more fantastic tech news.